everybody. So we are at another toy store and you know what that means. It means another adventure. So we are in Classic Plastics today and I wanted to take you on a tour of the store and show you all the cute things I found. So hold on tight. All right. So walking in, you start with some of the things that are in the glasses. We got some Transformers. We got some Bratz dolls. Definitely got some TMNT down there. Hot Wheels some Legos, kind of cool. Look at those gorgeous Transformers. Ooh, I like that sound wave. Hold please. Bumblebee's Greatest Hits. That's actually really cute, guys. I'm gonna have to look into that. All right, so we always start in this corner first because this is the Masters of the Universe section. So we got some of the newer stuff and then we've got our classics. Oh look guys, there is a Modulox. Thank goodness we don't need any more. And then we've got some of the newer stuff, which is cool, right? And then we have this really cool display case. Like, I kind of want this display case in my house. It's super cute. And then we got some loose ones up here with some pieces. And I don't know if you guys remember, but this is where we got our slime pit last time. And I wanted to show you some of the things I found up here. I really like this fantasy figure collector case. I am all about like the different versions of toys that look like He-Man, like the knockoffs. Like for example, let's take this guy right here. He's neat, right? And so is that guy. I want to see what his boots look like. Oh yeah. Definitely cool, right? All right. So moving on, you will see some turtle cases down there. Definitely some more turtle stuff. I really like that turtle watch, some turtle pins, you got some matchbox. All right, so then we go around this part. We got some Joes in the cabinets, right? Oh, look at that. That is a very nice display. That's gorgeous. And then, look who I found. I found my friend Teddy Rubskin, along with some wrestlers. Kind of cool. All right, so we've got randomness galore over here. And that's the thing about the store. They have so much cool stuff. You really just have to, like, look out and just, like, look for stuff. Because I really like this guy. He is so, listen to that. He does not play. I want to find out what he is, and I want to get him because he's super cool. These are on my to-get list eventually in life. Not something I need right now, but I kind of want them. Um, and then over here... These are like your bins you pick through, get some stuff. We normally get our son some cars. Like, I'm probably going to get him this one. Like, that's kind of cool. I think he'll like that. Um, you know, just like other little odds and ends down here. Some Transformers, loose ones down there. And look at these guys. I love those. And then we got some more stuff on the back wall. We got some Joes, some Simpsons. Those look like the new Joes that are out, actually. And we got a couple of them, so that's kind of cool. There's the Micro Machines. Love those guys. Some more Transformers. Some loose action figures. I dig it. Some zombie pops. Look at the Care Bears back there, guys. That's really neat. What is that mask? That's really creepy. I don't like it. All right. I'm going to bring you back to this. Look at this little dragon. <gasps> He's too cute. That's really adorable. And see, the problem is when you collect toys and you have kids, you blame everything on your kids. Look at this personal video player. I remember something very similar to this. And look, this is kind of, I don't like this version of the Power Rangers, though, but that's still kind of cool. And look, bins upon bins upon bins of toys. I think these are relatively new. I honestly don't remember these. But it's like a Domino's figure in there. These are neat. Okay, I'm going to have to dig through here later, like after we're done the video. I'm definitely going to do a dig. And into that one, too. So, yes. I'm going to be digging after the video. So we have Star Wars Pops. Got some other Pops. Some FNAF Pops. 
We got our superhero pops over here. Oh, guys, I like the green eggs and ham one and the fox and socks one. That's so cute. Like I said, they literally have a pop for everything. This is scary. I don't know what this is from, but it's don't starve the game. That's really creepy. All right, guys. We're going to go back this way, I think, because the back's kind of crowded. But, yeah, this is also where we got our... Um, that's kind of neat looking. That's, this is where we also got our Rescue Heroes monkey, I think it was. So, yeah, we get a lot of toys here all the time. And I'm grateful to them because of the slime pit. So we'll go back down this way. They got some loose Barbies. Oh, and some My Little Ponies. Thankfully, I never really got into those. And then, look, we got some more Transformers. Cool, right? Some newer Transformers. Ooh, look at the Sharktacons one, guys. I love those little guys. I think they're adorable. I like these, too. They're cute. Look at I love little collectibles. And then I was looking at all these Barbies up here, too, because I am now, unfortunately, I think I'm collecting Barbies. But look how beautiful. Angel Princess. <gasps> Disco Barbie. You might have to come home with me, Disco Barbie. Arctic Barbie. But, yeah, you got all these Barbies up here. Unfortunately, I might have to take one of them home. Cool. Let's see, look at all the cool stuff over here. We got some peanuts. We've got some brats. Right? And then I was really enamored by these guys. These like little knights people. But like this is the one I like. He's really cool looking. A little angry goblin. And then I don't know where these heads go. I'm pretty sure they're some type of Imaginax or something. I don't know. I had to figure that out. And then this guy was neat too. Look at He's really cool. He was one of my favorites. Like of course he got a Mr. Krabs in there. Oh, and I almost bought bought this because the Rat King. So I have this new Transformer figure and my son stole it from me and he walks around with it in the house and it makes me really sad because I want it back. Um But yeah, like little figurines. Ton, ton, ton of stuff. Yeah, I had it. Oh, there's a Chucky. Very nice. Yeah. All right, now we're moving on to the Star Wars, guys. Star Wars galore. If you are a Star Wars fan, this is where you need to go for all of your Star Wars collectibles. I promise you, they have a lot, a huge collection, new and old. Very cool. I think the coolest um, Star Wars action figure that we had was the the snow guy like the the snow yeti thing i can't think of the name today friends if you saw my other video you know why i'm just completely exhausted from that uh goodwill but um i want to say wampa but it was like the snow guy that han cut open to stay alive and i like that the action figure actually had his stomach cut open so that's cool to me oh look these are beautiful and i really like this cabinet too Nice, we got some Legos. Oh, look, we got a random Castle Grayskull on the floor. Got some Legos. Definitely got some Thundercats figures over there. Cool. Star Trek. This is a really nice display, the $6 million man display. Look at that. That is beautiful. I'm in love with it. All right. There's a GoBot lunchbox up there, guys. All right. Oh, we can't neglect the spawn action figures, too, by the way, because they're beautiful. So we're going to take a look at these. Love them. They're so cool. All right. So, look, we got some more spawns. <laughs> this made me laugh. Please tell me you remember this, guys. That's hilarious. And I want this. I really want this. They've known, my husband's known I want this for a while. So maybe I can convince him to let me take this home today. We'll see how nice he feels. Um, and then we have the video game section back here, and that's really cool. I kind of want that, too. 
plus this and Zephora. That's neat. But look, video game stuff. That's neat. And like a whole video game section. Cool. And then we are back over here. Oh, we got some more stuff in a case. Got some mangas. Some more pops. Oh, look. There's a Power Rangers nook. That's neat. Luckily, I think I have everything I need for the Power Rangers. I don't think I need any more. I think I'm good on my collection. I could be wrong. There could be something really neat out there that I missed. But, well, that is about it, guys. This is a really great store. They have a huge selection, a little bit of everything for everyone. Very reasonably priced. Really great service. You guys should really check it out. All right, guys. I will see you soon in the next video. Bye.